Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Styles. I'm here today with my buddy Barry here at Ten Point. We're going to be building some bows, showing y'all the factory. Uh, we're supposed to meet the owner, Rick, here today. We get to say what's up to him as well. We get to show y'all from the starting stage of how it ends, play some music for the staff. Follow us. Come on. So, this is the beginning stage this of the bow. Right here. Right here the first oh, wow. And just keep feeding that. Actually, uh, this arrow has been around since day one. It's called a double X75. It's an aluminum arrow. Nobody in the world still makes an aluminum crossbow arrow. We They've still all do. switched to carbon? Yeah, everything is carbon. We still do because there's still a lot of guys that still want to shoot them. Yeah, yeah. That's awesome, man. Wow. That is super cool. It's, it's all American. Yeah, right here. Made, yeah. That's the only, the the only items that we do not have anywhere between one and now this, now Wicked Ridge and Ten Point are both made here. Yep. Okay. Wow. That hooks up on the inside. Oh, cool. And, and honestly, there's a huge whatnot. difference between the two. The Garmin inside. actually sells for eight, if you had to buy it, you can buy it from, from Garmin. $18.99 is actually the same price points as, as the Horton. Cool. So we got rid of the Horton finally. Sure. Now we make Wicked Ridge and Ten Point. There is no difference between the two name brands mm -hmm. physically. Other than Wicked Ridge, we just don't put all the whistles and bells that is on the tin point. Line. Sure, sure. Same stock, same string, same limbs, same risers. Same factory. Same factory. Oh, we man. just uh, don't put a lot of stuff on them so we can keep the price down. Got it, got it. They start price point at $399 and they go to about $1,000. Tin point line starts at about $800 and it goes to $4,500. The box comes down the rail, connects to the string you bring back. An AccuDraw, the, the claw you grab and put on the string and crank it back. The new one that we're coming out with is very nice. So, and it's going to be on the Wicked Ridge one. Oh, cool. We're actually going to have a AccuSlide type system on a Wicked Ridge bow that's going to sell for like $7.99. Wow. They ain't going to beat that. It's going to, it's going to go nuts next year. Wow. Well, that's awesome that you guys do have the different tier levels of bows. You yeah, know? I mean, it, more if you want all the whistling bells, or if you not, want something more. Not everybody can buy a yeah. or a forty five. Yeah. 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 So that's really cool that you we, guys have we both. We try to have ranges of price, and I think it comes off here. That room back there is a shooting room, so every bow when it's done gets handed off to three people in there. They shoot it twice, really? and then it gets boxed. Right, goes comes back out here. They box it. And then they gets on pallets, and, and then the pallets twice. go back into there. there we go. Check this out. So I just noticed this right here at the Ten Point Factory. We got our buddies over at Big Shot Targets. Look at that. Number one target, probably the right four Big Shot Targets. targets. Probably the third set of targets in the shot We actually get boxes of limbs, and they're ready to go. Ready to other go. than us dipping. Wow. And our dipper is right down the street. Again, everything That's a good is connection. Yeah. Exactly. That's awesome, man. It's, like I was saying, all, being all American made like yeah. that is awesome. Man. That's, and that's why you guys got bows out on the market, and other guys um, are struggling to get them out there. Mm -hmm. You can do it wherever you want. They're literally going to go to lunch here in about 10 minutes. Okay. Cool. Well, we can grab the guitar. Yep. Lunch people that come here and, uh, you know, uh, lunch trucks. That's great. So we have lunch on Friday. Yeah, I saw your success. Three or four days a week, or three or four times a year, everybody gets two hours off, and I bring food trucks, and yeah. we hang out, you know, outside, and just kind of, I give a speech or whatever to say, you know, kind of where the state of the union is, right? right? Yep. And then, um, in fact, a lot of people have been here a long time. They're... That, you know, we have people that walk to work, you know, I mean, I, wow. it's just kind of a, we got 130 people now, so, yeah. you know, they're from all walks, all places, yeah. you know, that type of thing. So. Some of the guys in the factory have been there for 20 years. Over, wow. you know, got some, some yeah. pushing 25. Wow. wow. Yeah. That's, that's impressive. I'm going to get him back there to do this so they can go to lunch. You guys had good timing. So that is Rick, the owner, him yes. and dad started this. That's so cool, yeah. man. That it's done. Done. Where I'll tell Sean that you're going to do something so she can get the people together. Styles, this is Barb. Barb? She works in the marketing department. Hey, she also helps put all this together with Brian you did? Flaherty. Oh, I love Brian. Awesome. The reason why yeah, he is here, this, he has a brand new uh, video yeah, song that's coming out yeah. about his dad and teaching him how to hunt. He killed his very first deer. He grew up in Medina. 
Killed his very first deer with a 10 point. I don't know yeah. how many years ago. Yes. Yeah, yeah, 20 years 20 ago. years ago. Right, here's a song called My Kind of Living. The song is not out yet, it's brand new, so y'all get to hear it here. I think y'all re will uh, relate to this. Every morning start on a truck that's parked on a drive, cut through some tall pine trees. Cash a check at the bank, 20 in the tank, the last tree chain on some winter green. To some people it might sound a little strange. But if you're like me, you know what I mean when I say, Yeah, my kind of living is in the woods, sitting with a hound all sniffing down a big bird trail. Palm bank fishing, out of bonfire picking, cocaine tipping when the sun sinks down. Sunday morning, amen, thanking God for all I've been given. It's my kind of living. I got a good girl riding shotgun and a real one in a back on a floorboard. She likes to sing along to a wailing song. Good Lord, what more could I ask for? My kind of living is in the woods, sitting with a hound on snipping down a big buck trail. Palm bank fishing and a bonfire picking, cocaine tipping when the sun sinks down. Sunday morning, amen, thanking God for all I've been given. It's my kind of living. That's my kind of living. To some people, it might sound a little strange. But if you're like me, you know what I mean when I say, My kind of living is in the woods, sitting with a hand all sniffing down a big book trail. Palm bank fishing, round a bonfire bar picking, cocaine tipping when the sun sinks down. Sunday morning, amen, thanking God for all I've been given. Well, it's a simple way of life, but I'd be damned if it isn't. It's my kind of living. Yeah, that's my kind of living, yeah. Hey, thank you guys. Again, a big thank you. Thank you to all y'all for letting me interrupt y'all's day and, and uh, delaying your lunch. I apologize greatly. And a big thank you to all y'all at 10 Point for letting me come out and hang out here today. Y'all are awesome. So, thank so. you. Thank you. Thank you. Heck yeah, man, that's what we're here to do. All right, guys, so we're admitted over to the outlet here, and we're gonna be sighting in these new bows. 10 point, hook this up with two Havocs. We're gonna go sight them in. Come on, let's go check this out. That old 10 point. Are these light? You're a kid, you're a kid. No, those are all unlighted. How long ago did you get it? So this baggie, yeah. So the main problem with people with their new arrows and their new bows is when they put the knock in, they put it in wrong, and then they shoot it, and then they blow the bow up. So what we did when we made this alpha knock is we put a, a dimple on the top so you can actually feel it. You line that up with the cock band or, or the odd color band. Then that goes down when you load it, okay? That's why that's there. So always, I mean, this is very, very important. Always make sure that is lined up correctly. The glued-in version 
is because you don't have that problem. Right. And if you're just practicing and that's hunting, that's yeah, what you Yeah, you just shoot use. these in the field right. and you're hunting. These are just a hunting arrow. Yep. yep. I think I got so. them all in. My kind of living, stay in the woods, sitting with a hand all sniffing, got a big book trail, fine bank fishing, man, a five fly picking, cocaine tipping when the sun sinks down. Sunday morning, amen, thanking God for all I've been given. Well, it's a simple way of life, but I'd be damned if it isn't. It's my kind of living. Yeah, that's my kind of living, yeah. Hey, thank you guys. Again.
not, but... Good blood on the arrow, good clean pass through. Good shot. Should go far. Oh yeah. Nice big dog. Yeah, Game check. Nice and correct. Instead of kill. You can do a cross. Urban too, I know. North of 303. Stove.